Greetings and welcome back to the KTRIPS user tutorial videos. This video will guide you through the steps for a permit service to select the carrier to be issued a permit. Note, if a carrier is not selected, the permit will be issued in the name of the permit service and cannot be transferred. After using the permit wizard or choosing to go directly to the order permits page, the first step is to select the carrier that will actually be transporting the load. Permits ordered without the proper carrier name cannot be transferred or refunded. Carrier lookup can be accomplished using either the carrier name or USDOT number. Note, if a matching carrier is not found, you must return to the home screen to add them as a new company before proceeding. As matching characters are detected, a pick list will be available for you to choose from. Do not proceed with the permit process until you've clicked on the carrier name in blue and it has been selected as indicated by black text on a white background. Only then should you proceed with entering additional permit information and continuing with the order process. This concludes the KTRIPS user tutorial video on how a permit service must select carriers.